The Lano Davis, the Tushau of Toka Village in Region 9, is attending the 13th National Tushau's Council Conference ongoing at the Arthur Chong Conference Center. Speaking with the newsroom at the sidelines of the event, Davis recommended that in the coming years, as Guyana begins to reap the benefits from its petroleum sector, indigenous students must be given scholarships to study law. We had that in discussion um, from a council level and we think that it would be good if the, um, if the government would take some young people and offer scholarship for these um, um, young indigenous students where they can go and study law. Study law because it's something that is lacking in the communities where we don't have the legal, legal understanding of these different laws that govern the country from the community level. The village leader believes that with better understanding of local laws, indigenous communities will be better able to represent themselves. Mostly law, because that, that is something that's important. I, 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 not recently I traveled and I learned that that is something where the indigenous people could start from to, in order to represent themselves, have proper represent, representation in these areas to get um, where you could get back. They form themselves into groups and they could start um, negotiating and making proper deals for the communities. Davis explained that his village applied several months ago for their land to be extended since the population has significantly increased, but no movement has been made. He believes with more legal minds, the village will be able to negotiate better. The indigenous communities often find themselves in land conflicts with miners and the state. A report published by the Amarna People's Association in August detailed the challenges faced by indigenous residents in Region 7 with having their cases heard in the High Court. The report said the month of October marks 21 years since several communities of the Upper Marzuruni area in Region 7 filed court challenges seeking collective title over their customary lands. Bibi Katun, reporting for the newsroom.